Hello everyone, welcoming you to Shore of Search classes. And today we are looking at the IIT Jam 2024 paper for economics, question number 21. Let the production function be given by yt is equals to at, kt to the power alpha, ht to the power beta, and lt to the power 1 minus alpha minus beta. Where at is the level of total factor productivity, kt is the physical capital, ht is the human capital, and lt is the labor. Alpha is 1.1 by 5, beta is 2 by 5. If the growth rate of YT is 10%, growth rate of KT is 5%, growth rate of HT is 5%, and the growth rate of LT is 10%, then we want to find out the growth rate of AT. Okay, so let's jot down the information first. So we are given the production function YT is equals to AT into KT to the power alpha ht to the power beta lt to the power 1 minus alpha minus beta where alpha is 1 by 5 beta is 2 by 5 growth rate of output is what it is y dot by y right where y dot is derivative of y with respect to t that is given as 10 percent so that is 0 0.1 Then we have the growth rate of labor k dot by k, which is given as 5%. So you can write it as 5 by 100. We have the growth rate of human capital h dot by h. So that is again 5%, which is 5 by 100. And we have the growth rate of labor that is l dot by l that is given to be 10%. So that is 10 by 100. So maybe writing the first one also as 10 by 100. So from here, we need to find out A dot by A, growth rate of technology, right? So we can first start by taking log of the production function. So log yt is equals to log at plus alpha log kt plus beta log ht plus 1 minus alpha minus beta log lt and then we will differentiate with respect to time so that will be y dot by y on the left first term a dot by a alpha times k dot by k beta times h dot by h 1 minus alpha minus beta l dot by l so replacing the values, this will be 10 by 100 is equals to a dot by a. Alpha is 1 upon 5. This is 5 upon 100. Beta is 2 upon 5. And this will be 5 upon 100 plus 1 minus 1 by 5 into 2 by 5 into 10 by 100 so this 5 and 5 5 and 5 will get cancelled out so 10 by 100 is equals to a dot by a plus 1 upon 100 plus 2 upon 100 plus this will be 2 by 5 into 10 by 100 So that means if you take everything on the left side, so you have 4, 5, 6, and then that would be 7. So that a dot by a is 3 by 100, that is 3%. So going up to the options, that is option number B from the set. Thank you.